I mean, think about it. But you have no choice about sure, it. Sure, they're getting together well enough now, but... so much. They're still very think. young. I could really see them being One something in the future. Be married. Your feelings will grow stronger with time. Him and her? It would You'll be perfect. See. You'll see. And it would save You'll so see. much trouble. You'll see. What?! Mama? Uru, I don't understand. I thought you'd be happy about- About what, Ahadi? Happy that you're forcing love and commitment on our son? Forcing? What else do you call it? Uru, wait. I know Mufasa will come to love Sarabi in time. He already loves her. How would you know? And how would you know that King Kalfani will agree to this? Sarabi and Mufasa's union would ensure his pride has the right to hunt in the Pride Lands if their lands never heal. Oh, so you're doing it for politics and your precious traditions, is that it? No, that's not it! I'm just saying that both our prides will benefit from betrothing Mufasa and Sarabi. Will Mufasa and Sarabi benefit? Of course! We did, didn't we? What are you talking about? Well, us, Uru. We were betrothed to help our prides heal, but we still fell in love. Uru, what's wrong? What's wrong? How can you ask that? You're talking about taking a choice away from two cubs like our parents did to us. And then you have the audacity to say I'm in love with you. What? But Uru... You think I'm in love with you? All because we were betrothed? You can't just force love on someone, Ahadi. But... You married me. I married you because I had to, not because I loved you. I knew I had no choice ever since we were cubs. I hoped I would love you one day. I tell myself I do love you, but it's a lie. In spite of what you just said, Uru, I love you. I'll always love you, but I don't see how you're in the right to complain. My father betrothed us for you, your pride. I married you, not just to uphold my father's promise, but because I love you. And now you are taking my feelings and my father's promise and throwing them in my face. What? Ahadi. Tell me I'm wrong, Uru. Maybe my father should have left you and your family to die. And then we'd both be better off now, wouldn't we? <laughs> or if I'm... I'm... Oh, wait! Come back! I didn't mean it! Liar! Or wait! Please! Just run. Don't look back. Run. Until I can't hear them calling. Wait. Mufasa. I can't leave Mufasa. I, no. He's fine right now. I'll go back soon. Ahadi can take care of... No. I should go back now. But Ahadi... <laughs> Why? <laughs> Father, if you can hear me, tell me what I'm supposed to do. Why are you always silent when I need you most? <gasps> Rahima? <gasps> Uru, what are you doing here? What's wrong? Nothing. Nothing? Then why do tears stain such a pretty face? It's not nothing, it's... It's... Oh, go away. Very well. No, wait. Please. 
I could use a friend right now. Of course. Is there anything you need me to do to help? Just name it. I... I don't know. Uru, what happened? My... king and I had an argument. It was... very personal. And... and he... and he... <laughs> he doesn't respect my feelings. After what I do for him... <laughs> You and I have much in common. Oh, my apologies. No. It's okay. It's comforting. You know, I... I never did apologize for giving you those scratches. <laughs> you don't need to, Uru. It isn't the scars a lion has that's important. It's how he gets them. I can feel them. I know they are there. But I don't mind them. Because they remind me of you. The only lioness who has bested me in a fight. And won my respect. And my heart. That's the most beautiful thing anyone's ever said to me. Really? I'm only telling the truth. That's why it's so beautiful. You are beautiful. <laughs> Flatterer. <laughs> Don't tell me you're telling the truth again. But I am. Rahima, you always know what to say, don't you? No, not always. I sometimes have trouble with words. But when I'm with you, everything makes sense. Everything stands still. Timeless, everlasting, beautiful, like you. Hardy?
Oh, sweetheart. Don't worry, Ahadi. She will be back. Arguments happen. You both said some hurtful things that neither of you really meant. She'll be back because she loves you. No, mother. She doesn't. She said she doesn't, and never has, loved me. But the fact that she really meant it hurts more than anything.